Hello, and welcome to this data bite. Today, I will be walking you through the new errors experience for APM users. So what we've done here is essentially connect um, the analysis portion of APM errors to the triaging um, tasks that are associated with errors inbox. So when I click under triage here, you are now exposed to the errors inbox view of things. Please note that what you see here are intelligently created static error groups, and they are here to reduce the cognitive load and noise that might be associated with so many errors flooding your inbox. So we need these static error groups to be able to associate it with a triaging action, such as assigning it to a user or setting up a JIRA ticket. So let's close out of that. Now, click into er group errors, rather, apologies, brings up another familiar face, something reminiscent of APM errors. And it was formerly classified under events right here, but it's now all under triage. So one of the key things that I'd like to point out here is the ability to filter on different attributes to help narrow down and parse through what exactly you're looking for. We've also added the ability to cr dynamically create an error group, which is something that is different from the static grouping we had back over in the triage tab. This is especially useful for a user who is trying to slice and dice their data and conduct a more thorough analysis. We now support up to five attributes to group by. Now let's click into one of these error groups. Clicking into a dynamic error group now surfaces a really cool summary view, which provides context, like the filtering and the selection up here, just so that you don't lose track of that, and also a high-level view of the, with this graph on the left. We also surface any key attributes, as well as traces, if that is available. Now, the key highlight here is the triage box that I am circling which links you to the static group it belongs to. So you can start triaging the error group directly. You no longer have to jump out of this experience to triage or assign tickets. Um, everything is right here. So the last thing I'd like to call out is profiles. This is the profile and the con context rather of the dynamic error group. You can search, sort, and download the information as well. So stay tuned for profiling or profiles at the scope of all error events, which is coming soon. Um, but for now, that's all I have. And thanks for watching. Uh -huh.